problem in Texas for years. Thousands of untested rape kits just sitting in storage and putting important evidence in legal limbo. Fox 51's My Owens reports an East Texas organization is hoping to find a solution with a new documentary. Right now, more than 2,000 used rape kits sit untested, each one holding a story. I was pretty much passed around like a piece of meat. I fought back or how I could let this happen to me. Help me, please. I just want to be safe. As sexual assault survivors look for justice. We just can't leave these survivors waiting on answers for months and months and months. After a kit is used at a medical facility, it's turned over to law enforcement. And when the system works, it gets sent to the crime lab to be analyzed. But for many, that's when the wait starts. They can report a sexual assault, and then they get told that they're not going to have the results back for six months to a year. With this epidemic stemming from coast to coast, here in East Texas, they're hoping to take a stand through film. And right now, my name is on a box, on a shelf that has never been tested. This is just part of the HBO documentary called I Am Evidence. I can understand one city being negligent, but a nation? The East Texas Crisis Center held a special screening of the film in Tyler and hopes to open the lid on these closed cases. As soon as it can be made a top priority, the sooner the kids can be tested and the sooner survivors can get justice and the sooner perpetrators can be behind bars. Boxes filled with heartbreaking stories searching for answers. My Owens, Fox 51 News. Well, the ongoing backlog is an issue state lawmakers have been trying to fix for nearly 10 years. This month, House Bill 8 was introduced, aiming to get rape kits tested faster, in part by hiring more lab technicians.